Shalom, or praise to Yahweh, Shem Yahweh, Shabbat, Shem Kadash, the Bond of the Apostles, salute to brothers teaching the word in sincerity and in truth. Um, <clears throat> this video here, let me see if I can. This video, um, I'm not going to say too much on what's going on, but um, at the moment, this is like a, a, a protest. As you can see, you see what it's about on the screen. Um, you know, people are still, uh, you know, people are still coming against, um, you know, this system. Um, and, this, you know, that's pretty much the time we're living in. You know, where they, you know, you got people that are going to be more for the system and people that are against it. Um, but uh, uh, I'm going to do a separate video on this quickly, but I'm di uh, pretty much what I'm doing is I'm testing if uh, this channel's back up and running. Because, you know, um, Esau uh, has been, you know, clipping uh, channels left, right and centre. And that's another video I want to do separate. But, <clears throat> so, you know, pretty much we got other channels, backup channels. So if you don't catch us on one channel, we'll be on another channel. Because, uh, I mean, last week, you know, I pretty much clipped a whole bunch of videos and camps and all that. But, um, so, um, going into this, you know, um, and I don't, you know, I'm trying to say without saying too much, man, you know, let me get this, but they're doing this right now, you know, this is going on and, um, that's what's going on right now. Now, let me get the scripture here because this is in the scriptures, um, these uproars and stuff. Uh, second Ezra 9 and 1 he answered me then and said when thou uh, measure thou the time diligently in itself when thou seest part of the signs past which I have told thee before then thou shalt well understand that it is the very same time wherein the highest will begin to visit the world which he made okay so um, you know, those are time. That's that's the time we're in. Um, you know, measure the time diligently. You know, know. You know what's going on. Uh, yeah, and you know, with all these things that are taking place, you know, you, you know the people. A lot of people in the world, they they really a lot of them are in a zombie state. You know, they're still trying to. They want, you know, the the world to go back to what it was. You know. Uh, you know, um, and um, so they can indulge in those, you know, wicked lusts. And that's why this place needs cleaning up because we're spiritual men when we come to this knowledge and we can see, you know, the mass uh, wickedness and, and sins that are taking place all across the, the planet. You know, because even though the world's not being governed by the scriptures, man, um, it says, then. Therefore, when there shall be seen earthquakes and uproars of the people in the world, then thou shalt well understand that the Most High spake of those things from the days that were before thee, even from the beginning. So there's a lot of uproars, uprisings, and things of that nature taking place. And it's against, uh, you know, the system, you know, e Esau and his system. And that's signs of the end, you know, masses of people coming together you know, you know, pretty much cursing out the society. You know, and, and there's a reason, and you know, there's a reason for that. And it's, you know, basic scriptures, but, um, is it Isaiah 10? Isaiah 10 and 1. Woe unto them that decree unrighteous decrees and that right grievousness which they have prescribed. All right, to turn aside the needy from judgment, to take away the right from the poor of my people. And if you check it out in this society, you, you really ain't got no rights. What do they call it? Privileges. Um, you know, and these unrighteous decrees that are being put in place is, 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 is pissing people off. People are getting, you know, upset with all this. It 
So, you know, so the end of the day, um, that's why these, and you know what, and you know what's funny, man, because, um, you know, the little f privileges or freedoms that they thought they had, they took those away. So it's really got these people on edge. You know, like uh, before you had, you know, the bread and circuses. So what you do is people are pretty much slaves, but what you do is you keep them um, entertained. You know, keep them, you know, in the show, what did they show you that in, in the movie, The Agora? Or something like that. And they're basically, you keep the people entertained so they don't think about, you know, their oppression. <laughs> you know, bars, clubs, everything just open. Eat outs, f fairs, fun fairs, rides, you know. So the the people, they pretty much, uh, you know, they'll, uh, they're overly entertained. You know, the 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 serotonin's on spike, and so they don't see. But the scripture says, "Blessed are you, for you see, man. Your eyes see." And it's and it's all about being able to see. Let's see if I can find that. There's a couple of scriptures I can get on that. I don't know if that's the wording right, but I'm gonna see if the, if the one I'm thinking of. Uh, Matthew's 13 uh, and 10 and the disciples came and said unto him why speakest thou unto them in parables or well, even before that it says who, he, who have ears to hear let him hear and he's talking about your spiritual ears I'm talking about your spiritual ears and your spiritual eyes because another thing we can see is that the Lord Yehovah Shammah Shai is coming with those chariots you know, that's another thing that we can see. See, that's what the, the prophets do. They see things that were going to take place in the future and they tell, they prophesy of it, they speak on it before it happens. It says, and the disciples came and said unto him, Let, why speakest thou unto them in parables? He answered and said unto them, because it is given unto you to know the mysteries of the kingdom of, kingdom of heaven, but to them it is not given. Okay. And it goes on into it, going into scene because <clears throat> I want to read into it. For whosoever have to him shall be given, and he shall have more abundant. But whosoever have not from him shall be taken away, even that he have. <clears throat> Uh, Matthew's thirteen, thirteen. You know, I noticed, man. He saw, you know, he's trying to, you know, cut, uh, offset the the labors, you know, by all these, you know, clipping channels here and there, and you know, removing your camps, removing your, your speakings, removing, you know, just clipping them just outright flat, you know. Then you got new channels, and he starts messing with that. But, you know, obviously the word, if, if he has got to do that, that means that the word is definitely getting to him without a shadow of a doubt. Okay, it says, Therefore speak I to them in parables, because they seeing, see not, and hearing, they hear not, neither do they understand. And in them is fulfilled the prophecy of Isaiah, which said, By hearing ye shall hear, and shall not understand, and seeing ye shall see, and shall not perceive. For this people's heart is wax gross, and their ears are dull of hearing, and their eyes... They have closed, at least at any time they should see with their eyes and hear with their ears and should not understand with their heart and should be converted. I should heal them. But blessed are your eyes for you, for they see and your ears for they hear. For verily I say unto you that many prophets and righteous men have desired to see those things which ye see 
and have not seen them, and to hear those things which you hear and have not heard them. <clears throat> Let me go back to this clip here. So, like I was reading in Second Ezra, the, this is the, the bigger the bigger picture to to all these things, whether it be a riots, whether it be a, a sedition, seditions, whether it be up, up, uprisings, you know, whether it be more draconian measures, whether it be martial law, whether it be uh, earthquakes, whether it be uh, freak weather patterns, uh, city blackouts you know, uh, blood moons, signs in the skies, you know, all of these different things, uh, you know, is 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 the end times manifesting, you know, the manif the, the end times manifest. And that's why you got to keep your spiritual, your spirit, you know, your spiritual antennas up and because you got a lot of demons out here, man, you got a lot of spirits, you know, going buck wild, especially at the end, you got a lot of spirits going buck wild out here, you know. <clears throat> And um, you know, there's a lot of spirits running around out here. You know what is the scripture? Scripture says what's called Satan, a, a roaring lion or devouring lion. So Satan's all you know powered up and and stuff like that. Now with all with these protests and things that you see, you don't want to be caught up in this. You don't want to be caught up in this. You know. You, you had those different protests, you had the BLM and you had all types of different protests taking place. So you got all types of protests that take place. But um, as of now, it's people coming up against the, 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 the draconian measures, you know? So then people say, oh, this is like a scene out of George Orwell's. You know, but when you check it out, it was all in the scriptures before. What does it say in Second Ezra? It says, "A man shall desire to go into a city and shall not be able." What's that? Is martial law? They they locked down in. This. How are they going to be locked in a city? Or you you're not allowed out. They got to enforce that with um, with different with troops or with some type of guard. You know. So this is what's taking place out here, man. But, uh, you know, like I said, I know it's Esau's clipping, but, you know, it's Revelation 12 and 12. I'm going to do a separate video on this topic about Esau clipping videos, if the spirit wills, and clipping channels and stuff, because, you know, it, you know, it kind of is, you know, it's annoying, you know, you but you, you just set up another channel, you know, but, you know, it's just, it, it, but he's doing it because he's hurt and he's trying to, because there's so much GMS. But guess what? Is he going to clip everything? Yeah, he's so frustrated that eventually he's just going to clip everything because, you know, we don't stop, you know? Why? Because it's the Lord, Yahweh Shem Yahweh put a spirit on the prophets that they wouldn't stop, man. And there's a load of scriptures on that. Uh what did it say in Jeremiah? This word shall be um, a burning fire. I think there's a scripture that says that no man may gain, say, or resist, or something like that. You know, because word, words are powerful, man. So especially if you're speaking the words of the Heavenly Father. And the, and the, all, the, all the words of the Lord is going to manifest, man, like people getting trapped and dead. There's going to be a lot of judgments taking place out here. You know, you thought the word of the Lord was a joke, but you can't see. You, you ain't, you know, you ain't, ain't, ain't spiritual, man. All right. So I'm reading scriptures. I'm kind of doing a bit of talking too. Um, I want to get what I just mentioned, but let me get something in here quickly. Um... Second is just nine and four. Then thou shalt well understand that the Most High spake of those things from the days that were before thee, even from the beginning. For like as all that have, for like as all that is made in the world have a beginning and an end, and the end is manifest. 
Even so, the times also of the highest have plain beginnings in wonders and powerful works and endings in effects and signs. And the scripture says the end is manifest and I might call this video that or something else. Um... But like I said, there's 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 uh, prophecies of the Lord's return in the ships. So there's a lot that's 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 taking place, man. Um, you know, this is gonna be a quick video. This is this I could make this like an hour video, but it was meant to be a quick one on the topic of what's going on. But you see, you can't. You know, I'm trying to. There's things you don't want to say because you know you're gonna clip you, you, your stuff. I'm going to get to the point in this. Jeremiah 20 and 9. Then I said, I will not make mention of him, nor speak any more in his name. But his word was in my heart as a burning fire shut up in my bones. And I was weary with forbearing, and I could not stay. Um... You know, let me go up here. Let me go. Let me go up here. Uh, Jeremiah 20 and 7. O oh Lord, thou hast deceived me, and I was deceived. Thou art stronger than I, and hast prevailed. I am in derision daily. Everyone mocketh me. Yeah, when you know, being an Israelite and, and teaching this doesn't give you, you know, like. <coughs> <coughs> Yeah, it's like uh, Jay-Z or someone, you know, the whole, you know, concerts filled. You know, we don't get that. You know, if anything, you know, people want to separate from your company. You know, people call you uh, by different names or hate groups or, you know, pe with all this stuff that comes out of these, these people's mouths. But, uh, so that's what happens. You know, you, your family comes against you. All of this sort of stuff, right? Uh, Jeremiah 20 and 8. For since I spake, I cried out. I cried violence and spoke. Because the word of the Lord was made a reproach unto me and a derision daily. So, you know, pretty much you got to understand that we're condemning the world around you. And, and the people of the world, they of the world, they don't, they would do anything to defend it. What's that quote from the Matrix? <coughs> One of the brothers or even kind of mentions it a lot. Uh, they will always protect the system, you know. I can't remember the quote, man. But that's what people do. They protect, you know, the system around them. What did they, how was I say, man? Yeah. You know, yeah, you're not of the world, man. You know, he's not of the world. We're not of the world. So, you know, the world would love its own. So the world don't love us. They don't want to hear you condemning their way of life, their lifestyles, you know, their orgy parties and their, you know, their, you know, going to the fun fairs and, you know, just this world, man. They don't want to hear it getting condemned, you, you know. But guess what? That's what, the, that's what the prophets are set up to do and that's what's happening. So we're in the time of judgments. We're seriously in the time of judgments. Uh, nine. Then I said, I will not make mention of him, nor speak any more in his name. Because his word was in my heart as a burning fire shut up in my bones. And I was weary with forbearing and I could not stay. Uh, so the word is a fire, man. You know, the word is fire and you can't, you can't, can uh, you can't, can you know, the word is, you can't contain that. You know, and the Lord's got, so, so the word's powerful, man. What does the scripture say? The words will not return unto me void. Let's see if I can.
just gotta make sure I forgot that I've got my low on memory on this. Um, gotta clear up some memory <laughs> on this phone. Uh, Isaiah 55 11 So shall my word be that go forth out of my mouth It shall not return unto me void But it shall accomplish that which I please And it shall prosper in the thing whereto I send it it's, You know so The words of the Lord bro They're not, they're not um They're not gonna. They're not gonna um come be void. I read it again. So shall my word that go forth out of my mouth. So so shall my word be that go forth out of my mouth. It shall not return unto me void, but it will. Sh but it shall accomplish that which I please, and it shall prosper in the thing which you have sent it. And that's why you see in these uprisings, because the, the heavenly Father said that was gonna happen. And um, you know everything. You know that you do has a reaction. So, you know, a lot of people are going to get judged, man. They, they come, like, let's say you came scuffed against the, the men of the Lord. You've put that out there, man. So there's something is going to come back on you. You know, it's like when you had, um, you had the prophet and, um, I can't remember who it was, I think, was it? I can't remember who it was by name right now, but it said, oh yeah, bald head. Mark called him Boldhead. And then two she bears came out and tore them up. So, you know, that's the, you know, what I like to call it karma or whatever. But that's the uh, the, the rules of the Lord, man. He tells you that in 2nd Edges 9 too. Because they have abused and loathed my ways, they shall feel it with death by pain. You feel what I'm saying? So that's what that's what it's gonna be, man. Um now uh I'm not gonna talk about too much of these measures because that's when they wanna, you know, clip your stuff. What um You know, as you can see, man, um, <clears throat> excuse me, Yeah, as you can see on the screen, you know, um, you know, you can see this up, this this up, this thing. Now, this whole uh, system here, you know, it's gonna be, a, you know, one of like one of those post apocalyptic movies, which it is. It is like that anyway. It's like the scriptures prophesize, but you're gonna have, you know, people getting the chip to be able to do anything which the RFID chip is the mark of the beast. You know, you're going to have that going on. You're going to have, in, in order to do anything, to operate in it, you're going to have to have that mark. And then they got these, these look at these these people, man, these Robocops. They're going to be chipped too to enforce that. And that's why it, it's like this. It's, it's like, you know, the, you know, the, but that's where the, the test comes in. You know, the scriptures talks about the tribulation that shall try the world, man. So, so, are people, so a lot of people are going to fold or, you know what, I can't do anything. I need to just get the, the, the mark in my hands. You know, or you're going to have people, you know, that are like, you know what, to hell with that, man. I'd rather, you know, just do some off the grid stuff. So, you know, that's what that's what it is. Um So I'm gonna test I'm gonna this video if uh, I'm gonna see what channel I can put it put it on. If not I'll put it on one of the smaller ones that I got. 
in the background, you know. But you know, he so follows you anyway, so you, you 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 know you don't put GMS in front of it, or you might just give it a random name, and you know it's, you probably have fucking twenty subscribers, and the, the videos are still getting clipped, you know. So that's just that's just how that is right now. Um. I mean, look at this, look at this, man. Look at this. So anyway, man, pretty much, you know, made the point. You know, with that, I'm going to say Shalom, man.